Thank you very much, Jamie. Well, hundreds of people made their way to downtown to Savannah to see the greening of the fountain. Of course, it kicks off all things related to St. Patrick's Day. WTOC's Mike Seela takes us to Forsyth Park inside the annual ceremony. A big crowd gathered in Savannah's big park to witness firsthand the greening of the fountain. It's a Savannah tradition and you always have to come and partake in this. We just moved here a couple months ago and everyone told me that this is a big deal. So I wanted to experience it for the first time with my son. This year's Savannah St. Patrick's Day Parade Grand Marshal Michael Kenny did the honors of pouring in the green dye with the help of WTOC St. Patrick's Day coloring contest winner Maddox Elrod a first grader from Pinewood Christian Academy. And after a couple of minutes, the green started to flood. I just couldn't wait. I was looking so forward to this. It was really awesome. It really gives you the spirit of St. Patrick's Day and kind of rings in the, the celebration. I love it. The green in the fountain symbolizes the big start that St. Patrick's Day is soon going to be here. We fill this park with prayer, patriotism, and song. And this is the Savannah Irish we are thrilled to death. We would have it no other way. This is just the beginning. The greening of the fountain kicks off a week's worth of activities leading up to the 194th Savannah St. Patrick's Day Parade next Saturday. I'm so proud to be with him and be by his side. Perfect. Give me a drink. <laughs> That's what it's all about. In Savannah, Mike Sela, WTOC News. WTOC.